Welcome to ReFilm, the movie starts with an MMA fight between two fighters, in the present-day city of Haikuan, located in northern China. Initially, it feels like one of the fighters, Edison, will defeat his opponent easily. However, since he had fixed the fight, he acts as if he is hurt, and gives the opponent the win. As a result, he is rewarded with money. He then receives a call about another fight. He quickly goes to the pre-match event, where he declares he will win. In response, Ma Xiao, an influential sports reporter at Haikuan TV, questions him about a fight three years ago, where he fractured his arm in Universal Fighting King Championship, and was disgraced, when he attempted to bribe his opponent, Wu Liang into losing. Edison is enraged at this, and starts to make strides toward the reporter. However, before he can do so, he meets Wu Liang. Edison is seemingly afraid of Wu Liang, as memories of his arm fractures still haven't faded. He lets Edison know that Ma Xiao is his fiancé. Edison is taken aback by this new piece of information, and apologizes. Wu Liang then asks for a rematch, since Edison has recovered from his injury. Edison declines, stating he is still injured, and quickly exits the scene. The scene changes, and Edison is angry at Wu Liang for making him look like a fool, while being a superstar himself. He is jealous of him. Suddenly, he is pulled to the side by Ma Dong, who rigged matches for him. They are discussing a rigged match against Wu Liang, when Ma Xiao, who is close by making a call, eavesdrops on them. When she learns about the match being rigged, she secretly makes an audio recording of their conversation. However, she is caught while doing so. Edison, who was already angry with her due to the pre-match event fiasco, again charges her, but is stopped by Ma Dong. Here we learn that Ma Xiao is not only Wu Liang's girlfriend, but also the daughter of Ma Dong. Ma Xiao tries to flee with the recording, as she intends to release it, and reveal the horrid schemes of her father and his accomplice. She runs away to the building pool at the top, and is closely followed by Edison. A storm is also brewing up in the city. When she warns him to stay away, as she is trapped in front of the pool, her heel breaks and she falls into the pool. In a desperate attempt to rescue the tape, Edison jumps in after her and accidentally kisses her. This triggers a streak of lightning to strike them, causing some kind of chemical reaction. Later, the two are in the hospital. Initially all seems well, as the two seem fine, however, when they regain consciousness, they find they exchanged bodies when they were struck by lightning. The two rush outside their rooms, and start arguing with each other. When Wu Liang sees Ma Xiao, who is in Edison's body, and Edison, who is in Ma Xiao's body, argue, he quickly comes and starts beating the body of Edison, who he thinks has laid hands on his wife. Edison then starts to pretend as if he is Ma Xiao in her body, and calms him down. Later, the two meet up at the rooftop where the switch was made. To reverse the effect, they try electrocuting themselves, to mimic the event that happened before. They fail to do so. Later that day, they try to convince Ma Dong that they have switched bodies with each other, but to no avail. He tells Ma Xiao, in Edison's body, that he has to fight the match that was rigged against Wei Xiang. Ma Xiao refuses to do so, but after much squabbling and acclimating to their new bodies, the two realize they need one another. They then start to live each other's lives. Later, when they are at Ma Xiao's house, Diao, an office colleague who is in love with Ma Xiao, comes and visits her. Edison goes and greets him, while Ma Xiao hides in the closet. When Wu Liang comes, Diao also hides in the closet. Ma Xiao, who is already in the closet, pushes him out, prompting Wu Liang to throw him out of the window. Ma Xiao comes out of the closet and tries to hug her lover. When Wu Liang sees Edison's body hugging him, he throws him outside the building, injuring him. During the ambulance ride of the injured Ma Xiao and Edison's body, Edison entices her to continue his battle for Wu Liang's championship, by promising to be her trainer, otherwise he will sleep with Diao. In response, the injured Ma Xiao and Edison's body, starts doing push-ups to train for the fight. However, in the UK qualifying match in Macau, Ma Xiao and Edison's body loses embarrassingly to Wei Xiang, also known as the surgeon. Since she has limited experience in martial arts, it is of no surprise to the actual Edison. After that, when the two are arguing over their defeat, Edison is kidnapped by Wu Liang's men. Ma Xiao follows them on a bike. Following that, Wu Liang asks Edison to sit down. Suddenly Wu Liang's other girlfriend comes and hugs him. This is unacceptable to Ma Xiao in Edison's body. When Edison confronts him about this, Wu Liang replies that Ma Xiao was only his fiancée due to her contacts, and popularity in the public. If it weren't for that, who would marry that fat ugly woman? This breaks Ma Xiao's heart. Moreover, Wu Liang reveals to Edison, 
that he too is involved in the fight-fixing game, thanks to his powerful father Wuda, and that he has lost a lot of money as a result of Edison's defeats. This sudden onslaught of news is too much to handle for Ma Xiao, who then starts crying freely in Edison's body. Overhearing the conversation, Edison in Ma Xiao's body comes into the room and attacks Wu Liang. Wu Liang threatens him to return his money, or face the consequences. Now enraged by Wu Liang, Edison decides to become a true fighter. Even though he fails initially, there is a fire inside him, and he is determined. Ma Xiao asks him to give up, as he is getting beaten up regularly, but he refuses. One day, while the two are arguing that Edison should stop training, Ma Xiao gets a call from her father. During the call however, he is jumped by Wu Liang and his disciples. Wu Liang tries to scare Ma Dong into returning his money, but he is rescued by Edison and Ma Xiao, however, Edison learns from Wu Liang what truly transpired three years ago during their fight, when Edison fractured his arm. He had won the fight on points, but Wu Liang had bribed the referees into giving him the win. Furthermore, he had also set Edison up, taking a bribe before the match. Wu Liang also tricked his then fiancé Ma Xiao into reporting that story, even though it was fake. Now Ma Xiao knows this story, but she does not have the heart to tell it to Edison. The three then discuss what they should do about the money they owe Wu Liang. On Ma Dong's advice, they all go to the Rolling Lotus School in a remote monastery, for special training. When they reach there, the master is gone, but his deputy, Zhang Duyu, teaches them a variety of new techniques, through various unorthodox methods, such as sticking advertisements on cars, contesting an eagle to a staring contest, and slapping fishes that jump at them. While doing the fishing exercise, Ma Dong jumps inside to save Ma Xiao, and almost drowns. Since he narrowly survives, he needs care and attention. This results in Ma Dong and his daughter becoming closer, and the three enjoy a much deeper bond than before. They continue their training, and after repeatedly practicing, Edison manages to master it. In the end, he is so skilled and super fast, he is able to strike the master's deputy. However, most importantly, they learn about the devastating one-finger death, and lion's roar strikes. To challenge Wu Liang at the UFK title in Macau, Edison must defeat four warriors. After overcoming the first three with ease, Wu Liang orders him to lose to the fourth, Ken, one of his men, but Edison refuses. He says that he is confident that he will beat Ken, and plans to bet on himself, so that he could pay back Wu Liang. Wu Liang says he won't be able to beat him. Later, they both come into the ring to fight, and Wu Liang is almost proven right, as Ken is dominating the match. However, Ma Xiao noticed from the sidelines, that Ken is not using his ground game, and relying too much on striking abilities. She cries to Edison to tackle him and take the game into wrestling, rather than striking. This had a big impact on the game, as Ken is not as skilled at wrestling. However, he had immense strength, and almost overturns Edison's attempts, but Edison does not give up, and doesn't let go, despite the constant blows from Ken. In the end, Edison managed to win via submission. He achieved the impossible, and after the fight, the two challenge Wu Liang to a fight. Wu Liang kidnaps Ma Dong. He also tells Ma Xiao, that she was the one that made the report of Edison cheating viral, and hence played a vital part in Edison's downfall. Edison, in Ma Xiao's body, leaves, leaving Edison alone to face Wu Liang. To save her father, Ma Xiao in Edison's body then plans to agree, to be defeated in exchange for her father's safety. Wu Liang agrees. When the fight starts, they fight equally, as Edison does not want everyone to think he is cheating. Ma Xiao appears and supports Edison. When Edison, who is sitting after the second last round, is about to lose, Ma Xiao comes to him to give support. Then the two share a kiss. As a result, their earlier kiss effect is reversed, and they both are back into their own bodies. Now, Edison in his own body, strongly fights Wu Liang, and despite an injured arm, uses the tricks he learned at the Rolling Lotus School, and successfully manages to defeat him. Later, it is revealed that Edison had recorded Wu Liang, when they were making the deal to save Ma Xiao's father. As a result, Wu Liang and his team are arrested. Edison and Ma Xiao both live happily ever after.